Hi everyone, I'm Joanne. Welcome to my craft room. Um, today I'm actually going to do my page on camera and I'm on day four, which is tuck spot, which shouldn't be too difficult. Eh, you never know. <laughs> so I think um, the page that I have to use is vellum, which wouldn't be my first choice, but for this, um, I decided to take some pinkish tissue paper, and I think I'm going to put that down first. And all I did was pull a couple pages that I thought would look good with this. So other than that, I have no plan. I'm just going to, you know, do it as I go along here. I'm going to just put some um, glue stick on the tissue paper, and hopefully this will adhere properly. I think it will. I've done similar, but I've always put it down on the substrate first. All right, I think I'm going to put it like this. I'm trying to make it simple, so hopefully this video won't be too long, and I'll just kind of come up with something quickly. Yeah, that works just fine. I might have to put a little bit of glue stick up here. Try not to involve pieces of paper off my desk. All right, and I kind of like that it's hanging over there. All right, so I'm just gonna collage a little bit, I think, with some of these. I don't think I want another piece of vellum. <clears throat> I'm not sure why I pulled that out. But I like these, this combination here. I think that looks pretty good, and I think it looks good next to my throwback page. Um, and the only other thought I had was to maybe use a piece of the packing paper as the tuck spot. So I think that's what I'll do. So I think I'm just gonna collage a little bit on here. I'm gonna leave a piece, maybe that's what I'll, no, I'll put one of these, I think, on there. That's so pretty. I don't even know where I got these, honestly. I get so much stuff. All right, so let's just rip this. I said I kinda wanna make this really simple and quick and not overthink it, which easier said than done. Maybe I'll even leave that sticking out a little bit. I don't, I don't think I want to do that. So I'll just put this here. I need a piece of um, paper to glue on, but I don't have one, so I'll just use the magazine. Hope everybody's well. I am a little behind on this, which is fine. I hope to craft most of today. <clears throat> Excuse me. It's my morning voice catching up with me here. I, I haven't talked to anyone voice. Let me turn off the camera and clear my throat. All right, I think that'll be a little better. I didn't want to start coughing on camera like crazy here. All right, I like these butterflies and this here. I think it goes with the whole kind of theme I have going on, if there is one. Now, as a former English teacher, I know that's really not a theme, but the ELA definition of a theme anyway. I'm kind of talking nonsense this morning. So I'm in outside of Philadelphia in New Jersey, southern New Jersey. So we are supposed to not get the storm where I am. Philadelphia weather is usually my weather because I can be there really quickly in my car. And um, so if we're just gonna get rain. I was hoping we'd get a little snow. I know it was gonna turn over to rain, but um, it would have been fun to see you know, my kittens. They've never seen snow before because they're just, uh, they'll be 10 months old soon. I don't want to cover all this. 
Um, it would have been fun for them to see snow. But maybe around noon we'll get a couple little flurries. We'll see. But mainly a rain event, which is okay with me, honestly. Um, I used to love snow. And then I guess as I've gotten older and it's harder to drive in it, I like it a lot less. But it's Saturday and I don't have to drive anywhere, so I think I'm just going to get this tuck spot on here. How do I want it? Um, maybe kind of like that. Like I said, my goal is to make this page really, really easy. And I think this is just okay like this. So I do want to use some glue. Uh, one of my goals is to unclog that today. And um, I'm probably off, can't, off frame. So here, I'm just going to do this and this here. And stick this down and this is gonna be my tuck spot right here so that's gonna be my tuck spot um, I do want to um, oh, I'm trying to break that habit this year when I, when I record and I'm catching myself doing it already with this video I think who is it um, Angela, Car she does right, right, in her accent. It's kind of sweet, right, instead of um, um. If you follow any of her work, you know what I'm talking about. on here I think I, I kind of like that it's simple it's a tuck spot now what am I gonna what am I going to tuck in there that's the question <clears throat> so day four which is the fourth of January is actually um, my daughter's birthday and I did go over into Philly last night and dropped off her gifts to her and then we're going to go out to brunch um, next Saturday just she and I I could tuck something like this in here and just write you know happy birthday <clears throat> or I could do a tag I pulled my stuff out that I wanted for this junk journal, January. It's in a bin right next to my workstation. Um, um, <laughs> don't want that. I feel like I need something else on here, but do I really? <clears throat> Can't I just keep it plain and simple? I can, I can do whatever I want. I have an idea. I think what I tuck in there is less important, you know, for this process of what I'm doing video here. I think I might jazz this up just a little bit with some stenciling. Maybe that would be a good idea. And then it won't be so plain. I'm just looking, I know I have other stencils in here. Yeah, I think what I tuck in here is, I think I'm gonna do a tag or something and write about it being my daughter's birthday. So, let me just open this one. There's a couple more in it. I just pulled a few out. Do I like that? Or do I want some floral? image. I kind of like this. 
How many minutes am I up to already here? Oh, I'm doing good. <laughs> Six minutes. I thought I'd look up and it would be like 20. And I was going to, no, that's not working for me. So I think it would be even kind of cool if I just put it on here. This would have been a good throwback one. Um, and just kind of get it over all of it. Now I do have paste. I just have to find it. Is it up on my desk? No, it's not. I have that kind of stuff. Here it is right here. Texture paste, opaque mat. I have things in certain drawers, but um, are they there? It depends on when the last time I used it was, whether it's there or not. I think I'll just use that. Mm. This. I'm just looking for a good um, little tool here. I think this tool might be okay. And then, of course, I'm going to just have to let it dry and then write my note about my daughter's birthday, and that'll be that. Hopefully, this paste isn't dry. No, it's not. So it is going to be white. Now, here's a question. Do I want to put some color in it? No, I don't think I do. All right, I'm just going to Go over this a little bit here. Once I pull it up, there's no turning back. I think I'll add a little something something that I want. Oh, I like it. Yeah, that's a good idea. All right, I think it finishes it off nicely. And that's going to be day four. I just have to let that dry. Let me see. Yeah, I like it. It's pretty cool. All right. So there's day four. And uh, I'm just going to stick my little note in here when it's dry. And uh, yeah, hope you enjoy it. Have a great day, everybody. Happy Junk Journal January. And I'll be back to show you more spreads. I do, like I said, I'm not going to do every one on camera. But um yeah, I did this one because I thought it would be easy enough and I like it. So thumbs ups, always appreciated. Questions, comments below. And if you're not subscribed to my channel, I would love to have you. All right. Bye bye.